this video I'm going to show you how to wire an automotive coil to a small engine. Uh, this only works on engines with points and condenser ignition. So first what you want to do is you want to get access to your points. Um, this is just an old mag plate that I have set up for it. You're going to have your points right here. These open and close. One end of them is grounded. Then the other end goes to a terminal. Um, same thing with your condenser. One end is grounded, the other end goes to the same terminal. You want to take a wire um, from this terminal and you just want to have a long wire coming off of that. Um, if it's on a modern engine like this, usually it's going to be all soldered together and then there's going to be a wire going to your magneto. So just cut that off and then solder a new wire on it. And this wire coming from the magneto or I'm sorry, coming from the points is going to go to the negative on your automotive coil. The center one obviously goes to your spark plug and then the positive on the coil goes to the positive on your battery. Then the other end of the battery you just ground to the engine block. So that's basically how to do it. I made a little schematic here. And this shows basically how it works. You got your points. Um, your one end of your points and one end of your condenser gets connected to long wire, negative on the coil. The other two ends of those are both grounded. And then you just got. You can put an inline switch here to turn the ignition system off. And then that goes to your battery. Your battery is grounded, and then your spark plug is grounded. So anyways, hopes this helps anybody that's got a dead magneto. And yeah, that's basically how to do it.